Time for Ask the Excert. Expert, move over green and leafy kale and make room for cauliflower. Ah, the good old cauliflower craze really got into full swing last year and is still going strong as more people sing the praises of this forgotten vegetable. Diet, uh, registered dietitian Lori Meyer joins us now live about this. Uh, so, what's so good about the cauliflower? What's so good? It has almost everything in it. Really? I mean, really? We always think it's a cruciferous vegetable. Mm -hmm. When we think of cruciferous, we think of broccoli. And yeah. we think, oh gosh, broccoli is such a wonderful. Cauliflower is also. Looks boring. Looks it, like it, a, well, maybe because it's, it looks like maybe broccoli because it albino. Is, it's, it's bland, yeah. but that blandness <laughs> really is what makes it so bland versatile. But it's low calorie <laughs> and really low in carbs. It has mm. a lot of vitamin C. It has uh, vitamin K, folate, mm. a lot of the B vitamins, and then it has all of these phytochemicals that are helping to reduce heart disease and wow. cancer. Um, this is like a super helps food. with detoxification. So it really is a great vegetable. And luckily, we've been starting to eat more and more of it over the last couple of years. So and, it, and it's going strong. I mean, there's more and more recipes all the time. So with that, how do we get yeah. this superfood in our diet more often? Well, first of all, you want to pick a cauliflower. And I put this one here with the nice green leaves the on very it. very first That's one. a nice, fresh cauliflower. And so you're, that's what you want to see. Okay. If it's already kind of turning yellowish, it's kind of an old one, oh, get, okay. a, get, get a different one. So you're either going to break it into florets, which is the first little bowl, mm -hmm. uh -huh. or you're going to put it in the food processor and you pulse it like maybe 10 or 12 times to make rice. And that's the second bowl. Or the third bowl is a snow, and that's going to be at least 15 or 20 times that you pulse it to make it really fine. And so for different applications, you're going to use Sprinkle different Sprinkle that things. on salad? or Well, no, you you're going to use it. it. That oh. snow is going to actually become pizza crust. <laughs> so the first thing that people always did was they made the cauliflower potatoes. That was oh, the really? Atkins mm -hmm. diet. And so this is just the florets that are boiled. Mm -hmm. And I boiled those or cooked those with chicken stock. And then Does pureed, like pureed them. Yeah, and does. you can either add Throw uh, lots olive, of olive oil or butter to it. And so depending now, three-quarter cup of this potato potatoes between 40 to 90 calories depending on how much butter you eat. Okay. Yeah. A three quarter cup of regular mashed potatoes, 170 to 200 calories. So you're saving a lot. Right. Rice is the second thing that people started to make and this you just put it in the food pro or in the food processor, rice it. Now you can either steam it or the the okay. greatest now is heat your skillet turn the heat back down and then put the rice in, cover it five minutes and it's done. And you don't have all that extra water. And ah. then with that, then I sauteed some vegetables and I made fried rice out of it. So you can use that. This is a, a fettuccine time, Alfredo sauce. So yeah. you're just cooking the, the, the florets. These are the broccoli, or the, um, the the buffalo bites. Which I love. And then this is ah, pizza crust. Pizza. And pizza crust made out of cauliflower. And you can see, I mean, it's a it's a piece pretty of pretty sturdy. Crust. And yeah. that was using the snow, and you cook that, and then you add some cheese and egg to that, make your, make your pizza crust. And people are loving it, and good, because we're finally loving something that's good for us. That's right. Get more cauliflower in your life. And it's all online. If you have a question for our experts, email them at askthexpert at today's TMJ4, or give us a call.